Sam Altman unveils the future of AI insights and innovations revealed. Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. In today's must-watch video, we're diving into a groundbreaking interview from The Logan Bartlett Show, where Sam Altman, the CEO of OpenAI, reveals the future of artificial intelligence. Joined by Logan Bartlett, Sam gives us an exclusive look at the latest AI marvel, GPT-40, sharing not only its impressive capabilities, but also what we can anticipate from AI in the coming years. If you're curious about how AI is shaping our world, this is one episode you won't want to miss. Stay tuned as we unpack all the details. Who is Sam Altman? Sam Altman, born on April 22, 1985 in Chicago, Illinois, displayed a keen aptitude for numbers and computing from a young age. Altman attended Stanford University studying computer science, but dropped out after two years, finding real-world experiences like poker more educational than traditional lectures. In 2005, he founded Looped, a location-sharing app, which was one of the first companies funded by the startup accelerator Y Combinator. Despite initial challenges, Looped was eventually acquired by Green Dot in 2012 for $43 million. In 2014, Altman took over as president of Y Combinator, succeeding founder Paul Graham. Under his leadership, the accelerator flourished, assisting approximately 1,900 companies, including high-profile startups like Airbnb and Reddit. Altman's tenure at Y Combinator is noted for its significant expansion and influence in the tech startup ecosystem. In 2015, Altman co-founded OpenAI with notable figures like Elon Musk and Peter Thiel. OpenAI started with a bold vision and $1 billion in funding, aiming to develop artificial intelligence to benefit humanity. The founding of OpenAI was compared by Altman to the Manhattan Project, reflecting its ambitious scale. Under Altman's leadership, OpenAI made significant advancements in AI, notably through its development of large language models, LLMs, like GPT, and image-generating models like DAL-E. However, the rapid development of AI technologies also brought scrutiny from political leaders and the public, leading to global discussions on AI safety and ethics. In 2023, Altman faced a significant challenge when he was briefly removed from his CEO position at OpenAI due to issues with board communication. After a tumultuous period, including widespread support from OpenAI employees, Altman was reinstated, highlighting the complex dynamics of corporate governance in innovative tech companies. What's the big deal with GPT-40? Next up, let's talk about GPT-40. This isn't just another step up, it's a giant leap. GPT-40 has brought something to the table that we've all been waiting for, multimodal capabilities. This means it can understand and generate text, cope with voice commands, and even make sense of visual information. Imagine having a conversation with AI that feels as natural as chatting with a friend. That's what we're looking at with GPT-40. Sam Altman didn't just give us a run-of-the-mill update. He emphasized how this version is all about seamless integration and fluid interactions. This breakthrough is pointing towards a future where AI systems become more intuitive, more responsive, and a whole lot smarter, transforming how we interact with technology on a daily basis. The personal cost of pioneering AI. Switching gears, Altman also got real about what it's like to be at the forefront of such a revolutionary field. Leading open AI has its perks but it comes with its share of sacrifices, like his privacy. Imagine being known worldwide, not just in tech circles, but everywhere. That's the reality for Altman. His work, while pushing the boundaries of what's possible, has thrust him into the spotlight, impacting his life in profound ways. This candid share added a personal touch to the discussion, reminding us that behind every groundbreaking innovation is a human story. It's not just about the technology, it's about the people who make it happen. Breaking barriers with efficient AI. GPT-40 has been optimized to such an extent that even free users can get their hands on it. That's right. You don't need the deep pockets of a corporation to leverage some of the most advanced AI tools on the market. This is huge because it opens up a plethora of opportunities, not just for big tech firms, but for startups, educators, and even everyday tech enthusiasts. The ability of GPT-40 to run efficiently means that it uses less computational power to do more. 
This not only makes it more sustainable, but also aligns with OpenAI's mission to democratize AI technology. Imagine small businesses optimizing their operations with AI, or students in remote areas accessing cutting-edge technology for learning. That's the level of transformation we're talking about. AI's growing influence on the global economy. Moving on, Sam Altman didn't shy away from discussing the elephant in the room. The economic impact of AI technologies like ChatGPT. It's no secret that AI has been a game changer in sectors where efficiency is key. Take customer support, for example. AI has drastically reduced wait times and improved service quality. But the question remains, what does this mean for the broader economy? Altman suggests that while we've seen significant improvements in productivity and user capabilities in certain areas, the full economic impact of AI is still unfolding. We're at the tip of the iceberg, folks. AI's potential to enhance productivity could lead to economic growth in ways we haven't even fully realized yet. But it's not all roses. As AI takes on more tasks, we also need to consider its implications on employment and skills in the workforce. AI and the future of coding. Now let's talk about coding. According to Sam Altman, AI is set to revolutionize this field. But what does that actually mean? Well, it's about making coding more accessible. Imagine a world where the barrier to programming is significantly lowered, where AI tools help bridge the gap between complex coding processes and people with innovative ideas but limited coding skills. This shift could democratize technology creation, enabling more individuals and businesses to develop apps, automate tasks, or even enter new markets. It's not just about making coding easier. It's about empowering a whole new generation of tech enthusiasts and entrepreneurs to bring their visions to life without the steep learning curve traditionally associated with programming. The ethical landscape of AI deployment. However, with great power comes great responsibility. As AI technologies like these become more prevalent, the conversation naturally shifts to the ethical side of things. Altman isn't just thinking about what AI can do. He's deeply concerned with how it should be done. Ethical AI deployment is crucial. We're talking about ensuring that AI systems are designed and used in a way that respects privacy, ensures fairness, and is transparent. But that's not all. As AI starts performing more complex and critical tasks, the potential for unintended consequences grows. This is where the idea of a regulatory framework comes into play. The need for AI regulation. Altman believes that as AI becomes more powerful and integral to our societal functions, there might be a need to develop new regulatory frameworks to manage its impact. This isn't about stifling innovation. It's about guiding it in a direction that is beneficial for all. How do we ensure that AI is not just efficient and effective, but also safe and fair? These are the questions that need answers, and they need them soon. The future of AI isn't just about technological advancements. It's also about the governance structures we put in place. It's about creating a balanced approach that fosters innovation while mitigating risks. As we move forward, the role of policymakers, technologists, and the public will be crucial in shaping an AI-driven world that aligns with our collective values and needs. Thanks for watching today's video. If you found this deep dive into the future of AI with Sam Altman insightful, don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell so you never miss out on our upcoming videos. Have thoughts or questions about today's content? Drop a comment below. We love hearing from you. Until next time, keep exploring, stay curious, and we'll see you in the next video.